Life of Hell Incorporated, baby. <laughs> What's going on with y'all? Today, I have a review that is long overdue. I've been wanting this ever since 2014 when I first sampled it. I present to you I don't know if you guys can get a good look at this, but look at what this says. That says Tuscan leather. Tom Ford Tuscan leather. I've been wanting this fragrance ever since 2014. Fragrance Net had it for a reasonable deal. You know, the big, the small is one ninety eight. The big one is two eighty eight. I told myself I want to get the big bottle for Christmas. The big bottle will last a lot longer than this one point seven ounce. But that big bottle after tax, that's running you like three hundred and some. This came to like two hundred and some after tax. Um, this right here, I see why Drake made a song about this fragrance right here. I mean, if I had to describe Tom Ford Tuscan leather, I would just say that it is luminous, sophisticated, the epitome of wealth and elegance in a bottle. And I'm going to give you guys a good look at this bottle. This is the bottle. It's the box, you know, it comes up out of the box. This is the full presentation right here. This is the shit in a bottle. Um, you got great projection, great sprayer, very good sprayer. Man, I just love the presentation of these bottles very elegant you see tom ford in the um in the head of the bottle gold plated the presentation is just the epitome of elegance it goes back into the little box with the sleeve you know to cover it up you know um this right here is a masterpiece the projection of this fragrance, I say it's a straight 10. It lasts on you all day. You still you still have the scent on your clothes the next day. I mean, this is just the truth. If I had to rate this fragrance from one to 10, I give this performance fragrance right here. I give this fragrance a 10 out of 10. This is a straight 10 out of 10, you know, I mean, it's just it's just a masterpiece. I mean, when you spray it, it just smells like a nice, rich, elegant leather. Um, just luxurious. It makes you think about wealth. I mean, this is something that I feel every man should have in his arsenal. Tom Ford Tuscan Leather. This is the shit in a bottle right here. The shit. I fuck with that heavy. I mean, if you want something that represents wealth, if you want something that represents financial prosperity, this is what that smells like in a bottle. Um, it has like a, a smoky essence to it. I mean unlike anything that I've ever sampled before. And like I said, I've been wanting this cologne ever since 2014. From the first time that I sampled it when I was in Neiman Marcus, I fell in love with it instantly. And I understand why Drake made a song about Tuscan leather. I mean, it's the shit. If you haven't sampled it, make sure you go to your Neiman Marcus Nordstrom, Bloomingdale's, Saks Fifth Avenue, 
you know, you know, make sure you go to any of your retail stores and give it a shot. Now, if you go to Fragrance Net, you can get it for a fraction of the price. But on Tom Ford fragrances, he's not cutting his fragrances down too much. You know, he, he not cutting the price down too much. You know, even on Fragrance Net, those fragrances, you know, they still kind of pricey. They, they really and truly are. But when it comes to Tom Ford fragrances, in my personal opinion, they are well worth the money. They, they last long. The longevity is great. And they truly are masterpiece creations. Tom Ford fragrances, masterpiece creations. Um, I fuck with Tom Ford all day. Tom Ford is the shit. Even your rapper Jay-Z made a song called Tom Ford. And I understand why. <laughs> yeah, Tom Ford is the shit. And I'm happy that I finally got this fragrance. Um, I've been wanting this, you know, for six years. I've been wanting this cologne ever since 2014. And I finally got it here. I want to get the big bottle for Christmas, you know. And um, I've sampled some other great fragrances from Tom Ford that I would like to get and review in the future. But um, make sure you give this fragrance right here a try. Make sure you get down to your retail stores and give this Tuscan leather a try because this is the shit. And like I said, I've been wanting this fragrance. It's 2020 now. I've been wanting this cologne ever since 2014. When I sampled it for the first time. So. um, And I believe. This. um f c Fragrance was released back in 2013. If I'm not mistaken. But. um, Feel free to get this shit a try. You won't be disappointed. Wealth. Elegance. Financial prosperity. Those are terms that I use to describe this fragrance right here, because that's what it smells like. A true masterpiece creation. But um, this has been Life of Hell Incorporated. You know, something a little different this time. Thought I'd do a fragrance review on a cologne that I've been wanting for a while that I dearly love. But um, I'm going to go ahead and sign out. Make sure you give this one a try. You will not be disappointed. But all right, this has been Life of Hell Incorporated.